Hollywood Pacifica film is celebrating 16 years and showing no signs of slowing down. Organiser Craig Fussy joins us now along with director Ian Opipi who is going to tell us about his award winning film My Friend Michael Jones and Simone Kaho whose very impressive film Blown is also part of the festival. Hey welcome to you all. Yeah, welcome. Thank Lovely you. to have you here. You. Uh, Craig I think we were having this conversation last year going 15 years that's amazing and now you're back with 16 years it's very impressive. Crazy to still be going but yeah. um, happy to be that driving force and very thankful for the people that have been involved, organisations um, across the board just helping Hollywood keep it going today. Mm. Yeah and it's a great showcase of talent which we're really impressed about and you had to choose seven films. How many did you start with when you first were looking? All up the telly came to about 40, 40 odd films. Wow. Um, selection process was ridiculous, the standard of work was amazing. Uh, trying to cull them back to seven was a, was a challenge in itself. Mm. I think um, in all there could have been like three Pollywoods to be honest. There mm. was that uh, much good work to be to be shown but in, in saying that there has to be a, a, a nine minute culling cull and um, in this case it's ended up with seven amazing films that I think the public will enjoy. Because mm, 90 minutes of short films is a good amount to sit through and watch isn't it? Um, now Ian you are the co-director and one of the writers of one of these films My Friend Michael Jones and congratulations because you just won Thanks. Best New Zealand Short Film in the Show Me Shorts Film Festival. Uh, well done. Thank you. That's yeah. awesome. So what does it mean to you? Um, well a lot. Uh, Show Me Shorts does a fantastic job in boosting the sort of profiles of all these films um, whether they come from the uh, overseas or they're here and now our um, backyard so basically um, means a lot we won best New Zealand film which is um, an awesome award uh, basically it, um, it gains you gives you access to um, the Academy Awards you're able to submit ov obviously yeah. but um, aside from that it's also like a bunch of uh, we won best screenplay and also our best act, um, our main uh, actor Vila Junior Limanu won um, best actor so we're really stoked for him as well. Wow. Yeah, and well deserved. I've seen it. I think it's absolutely brilliant. For those that haven't seen it, how would you explain it? What is it about? Um, it's a story of friendship and acceptance. Basically, it follows the story of a, a young Pacific boy, um, teenager who is sort of ostracised at his high school for his mental condition, and um, he gets picked on for it. Uh, essentially, he uh, his sort of biggest nemesis at school and becomes the sort of unlike they sort of form this unlikely friendship through their shared. Uh, passion for music and dance and together they use that to mm. escape from their social um, pressures. It sounds yeah. awesome. Why don't we have a look at it actually? Yeah, let's do that. Yeah. What you had to do, also. You did what you had to do. Oh, wow, so good. looks amazing, yeah, Ian. Now, Simone, let's talk about your film, Blow, and you're the writer as well as the director of the film. So, what's it all about? So, uh, Blown is an action film, it's a film about love and natural justice. So the protagonist is a guy called Andy who comes from a violent past, troubled past, and he's turned a corner in his life. He now works with at-risk youth. He's fallen in love and he thinks that this is, he's got it made. Then he wakes up one day, his fiance is gone. He goes looking for her and it all floods back on him. When he finds her, the reality of what the problem is is darker than he thought. It's, it's about sexual assault and female rage. Ooh. Okay, well given all of that, for those that were listening, let's take a look and see how it all unfolds. I found that the most violent men, <coughs> usually the most broken men, we're all broken in our own way. And it's our job to find our strength. What do you think, Tomo? She's crazy! Hi, you've reached Narelle. I can't take your call right now. Please leave a message. Get your hands off me, bro, before I have you done for assault, huh? Where's Narelle? Tell me everything. My friends have been attacked. Someone's gone to do something. Gosh, looks amazing. So many good films. Craig, um, can you tell us about some of the other films in the festival? Other films, um, Representation of Cultures, Boy from Rarotonga is by Joshua Tiariki Baker, um, estranged grandmother getting used to looking after her grandson after just meeting. Very interesting situation. Moon Melon by 
Trina Peters depicts a whole lot of young women breaking the gender types, the cultural boundaries of, of how they are depicted in society, uh, ending up in a very mysterious circumstance. Uh, Aruna Po Ching with Salah Messina's uh, daughters, they uh, talk about um, women in, in an oratory position with uh, Samoan culture. So they're taken over and, and basically doing, doing them proud with the, with the women's side of things. Uh, Strong followed by Jared O'Keefe um, is a Vanuatu based film and I think quite a, a lovely comment on that small nation. And finally with uh, Tiki X823, Jason Tilma, uh, a cultural Polynesian science fiction film that must be seen to uh, be believed. Sounds wow. awesome. Hey, thank you all so much for coming in. Yeah, thanks. This, well done too. Awesome. Yeah, yeah. This year's Pollywood Pacifica Film Festival screens on Sunday at the Mangari Arts Centre and tickets are available via Event Finder.